Good morning. You can't even see me. It is um, going on 10 a.m. and I'm going over to my friend Dee, her vet clinic. That's where Bruno goes to Montessori and I'm going to do her hair there. Um, she is going to probably, probably be on a TV show. I'll tell you more about that later. Um, and I'm going to do her hair, but I wanted to show you, we got a lot of snow. It started Christmas and it snowed all day yesterday and it looks like it's going to be clear today, which is just wonderful because I left my sunglasses at home. Because uh, I can't tell what the weather is at our house. So there's that view and here's this view. With all of the cars, so it's 9.53 a.m. And it's just so pretty. You know, you're pretty much guaranteed a white winter here. And a white Halloween and of course Thanksgiving, New Year's. Valentine's Day, Easter, not Memorial Day, but all the other ones. And it says it's 10. I'm going to miss that light. Uh, I don't know. It's probably, you know, it dropped down to 9 because I just came out of the warm garage. And seeing that it cleared up probably means it's going to be colder. So... And the roads are pretty good. There's snow, so there's a lot of traction. Um, not icy. Well, here on the highway it might be, but. Anyway, I hope you guys all had a wonderful Christmas. Um, Hanukkah, whatever. And, okay, we're down to three. So maybe I'll do a little recording if Dee is up to it if she lets me. She's such a sweetheart. And um, yeah, so I'm back to working on a Saturday morning again. Isn't that funny? Okay, well I'm gonna let you go and I'll just talk to you later. Bye. Okay, we're getting closer. And the ice fog is out and now it says seven below. So, we are closer to normal temps now. Normally we're about probably 20 below this time of year. But see all that gravel on the road? That's pea gravel. That's why the windshield looks like that. So I think I'm gonna get it fixed in the spring uh, after they sweep up the gravel because Mike is debating, well, it will just depend. He's thinking about using, selling his big Dodge Durango. It has a Hemi engine and it sucks down gas. And mine is a lot more gas efficient. Um, so, and his vehicle is a 2000, I mean, yeah, 2003? Three or four. So that's like, you know, 10, 11, 12 years old. Mine is about seven years old my Equinox and so I'm almost there there's our animal shelter and there's a spirit of Alaska little kiosk and move over surgery center that's relatively new they opened that up a few years ago. Maybe three or four years ago, maybe? I don't know. Well, anywho, here I am. I'm coming up to Animal House, Veterinary Hospital, and Hair Salon. Ah, home of Noah's Ark. Pet Lodging, Grooming, Petting Supplies, and Mudasori School for Dogs. So this is Dee's encampment is what I call it. It's a huge place. Huge.
huge, huge place. So, and then they have this um, coffee and food hut. So, looks really pretty. Decorated the trees, dirty dog. Okay guys, um, maybe I'll see you inside. Look at that, isn't that cute? Okay, bye. Well, I didn't record when I was doing Dee's hair because I kind of forgot. We got talking and, um, but she had this nice basket for me. Dog treats and little ones for Emmy. And then um, gift cards for the place over here, the Brazen Bold Cuisine. And then this bottle of Amarula cream liqueur. She said it's really good. And a big squeaky toy for Bruno. And then, ooh, duck breast chewy treats. So she hooked me up good. And there she is. Bye, Dee. All right, now I'm going to head over to Merle Norman. Look at that snow pile. Holy shit. Oh, sorry. I say that all the time. I say, holy shit balls. Because Mike said that to me once. Look at our gate here. Quite the compound. And, I don't know, that was a year or two ago, and I said something to Mike. I got up in the morning. I think he was already. Said, oh wow it snowed out and he looked outside and he said holy shit balls I thought that was so funny that I say it so what is the best way to get over there hmm is that probably University, I think. So this is winter. It's now noon. And this is what we get. Oh, there's a cop. Okay, I'm gonna get off now. University. I'm going to go up to college. Because that's. Dude, what are you taking up the whole freaking road? Oh, good God. I guess. There's the university over there, University of Alaska Fairbanks, and this is kind of the university area with all the little shops and and here is the uh, UAF sign over here on the left. I don't know if we're going to be able to see it much. There it is. It gives the temperature so the students or just people will, when it's like 40, 50 below, they'll stand out there in bikinis and whatnot. Gulliver's Books, I love that store. It's a used, new and used bookstore. So if you, sorry, if you, uh, oh, there's a raven on top of that pole and knocked some snow off. Um, 
if you take and use books that they want, then you get credit for used books. There's Beaver Sport. Oh no. I guess we passed that out already. Did we? Or is it coming up? I don't know. I haven't been down this way in a long time. Now, where I'm going, that's the building where I used to do Zumba. But when the weather's like this, honestly, I don't want to go out. And, um, to exercise. And buy a punch card and I'd always have a couple of classes that I just didn't use with our traveling and everything. So there's the Material Girls. It's a really nice fabric and sewing store. The Woodway up here on the left, they sell um, wood burning stoves and that kind of stuff. Jeez, take up the whole freaking road, lady. So this is Artisan's Courtyard, and there's In My Element, there's the Merle Norman store. So it looks like I'm gonna have to go around, and this is where I would take Zumba classes. Take five, coffee shop. I'm gonna check out Merle Norman. Hopefully they're open. Um, so yeah. That's where I am. And then after here, I'm going to Walmart to get my prescriptions and some groceries. See you later. Hey guys, so I'm in the bathroom here at Artisan's Courtyard and the Merle Norman store is closed. It's the Saturday after Christmas and they're freaking closed. So if they have a Facebook page, I'm gonna make a comment on there. It's no wonder that businesses here in Fairbanks um, fail. So, I have on my sorrel boots and um, some leggings I got at Marshall's, just a t-shirt and then this little jacket and my um, lightweight down coat. All right, well, so much for that. Unbelievable. So it looks like they're having a Zumba class, but I don't know if it's Phoebe. Look at this. Really? the Saturday after Christmas. So that means they were closed yesterday as well. And they're closed too. Wow. Okay. And there's the bus. I'm gonna start my car. I'm going to try to do a workout, but I'm getting a cold, so I'm not feeling really good. Back in my car. All right, well, I'm going to Walmart, so I guess I'll just see you guys when I see you in my next video. You take care. Merry Christmas. Oh, we already did that. Happy New Year. <laughs> I'll talk to you before then. Bye.